back near the plaza, 36, still murky, still misty, fog in the morning, and temperatures will continue to drop off. I'm going for 26 in Maryville, 28 degrees in St. Joe, about 30 degrees for Clinton, and because of that, as we're clearing out frost as possible, that means some refreezing, or refreezing could take place. Whatever is liquid could become ice, not a skating rink necessarily, but don't let your guard down totally because in some areas, especially getting out to your own individual neighborhoods, that could be a tough go, especially if there's ponding right now. But in the afternoon hours, I think we're going to see a lot more blue than we've seen in recent memory, and temperatures will bounce back. Our normal high is about 35 degrees, but we're going to be well into the 40s. It'll get breezy out of the southwest at around 10 to 20 miles per hour, so some clouds peel. And we're going to see a good deal of sunshine heading into Wednesday as well. Here's future scan as we pick it up. Too light to be detected by radar. The mist and fog will still be overhead. Some areas will see breaks in the overcast. And then another little spoke of energy moves down pre dawn through the first portion of the day. Could give us a few mix of mist and flakes. Otherwise, your temperatures tomorrow 41 Kansas City, 48 for Butler, 44 as you're heading down toward Paola. High temperature in Trenton of 41 degrees. So things are definitely warming up a little bit. Thanks to a little bit of sunshine. Seven day forecast has that chance of a little bit of mist or flakes. Breezy, 41. Then we go 27 to 40 degrees on Wednesday. Thursday, no issue at all. 27 to 47 degrees, and it stays mild Friday and Saturday. Morning temps close to freezing, but finally above. 52 both days as it stays mild. Then another system moves in, this time with a chance of rain as opposed to snow or even a mix. I don't think we have to even worry about. Uh, any sort of icing, at least that's the way it's looking right now. And we have too much rain. <laughs> we don't really need any more, but it looks like at least a 20 to a 40% chance coming in Sunday into Monday.